Well, Hamzat, what an amazing performance, but kind of to be expected from you at this point. Was that the fight you were expecting from Robert Whitaker, though? Yeah, of course, but I know my wrestling skills is highest than anyone, you know, so I was, uh, I trust my skills, just went in straight away, take, take him down and finish the guy. To get a first round finish over a veteran like Robert Whitaker, a former champion, what goes through your mind in the moment when you feel the tap and you get your arm raised in the octagon? Feels amazing, but I thought I was going to finish him uh, late in the rounds, but it works off in the first round, so I'm happy. Walk me through the finish a little bit from the takedown. All of the transitions through all of the positions were beautiful. You maintained control the entire time. Did you feel his jaw before the tap? Yeah, I feel like some click, so maybe I broke his chin, I don't know. So I hope he's good. Uh, this, is, this is the job. Sometimes somebody hurts to make somebody happy. Well, it definitely made you happy. You've been very respectful all week. You've said that Robert is uh, a hero of yours in some ways. How difficult is it for you to fight someone that you've looked up to throughout your career and to actually stand across from them in the octagon? You know, I didn't want to fight with Rob, but they give it for me. It was one way I, would. I like to fight the guys who don't like me, you know. So it makes me more hungry, more motivated, more like angry and finish somebody. Rob is that kind of guy who I look up to, you know. So I want to be like Rob, fighter, and be, he being a champion when I start to fight. So, yeah, but he's, but he is, I don't know what, what to say. So thanks, thanks for Rob. Uh, it makes me a better fighter today. Definitely a different type of challenge for you, I think, heading into the octagon against an opponent that you look up to. When you think of what's next, you already made it super clear what you want, but do you think you did enough tonight to secure a title shot in the middleweight division? I think so. So we'll see. I, I can't, can't say anything. So I wait just Dana White, what he says. We're going to do that. So he's my big brother. Whatever he says, I say yes. I think the better question would be, in what ways would the champion Drikas Duplessis challenge you that's different from all of the other opponents that you faced? I don't know. We'll see in the cage. That guy is a strong guy. Like, you know, he's, he's a wrestler as well, but I'm a better wrestler than him. So I think I can finish that guy. Oh. And I have to ask, because we just watched Ilya Tapuria finish Max Holloway. Just initial thoughts on a champion like that, says what he's going to do, goes out and does it. You do the same. Your thoughts on Ilya as a champion? Congratulations for Georgia and for Spain. So, they are a great champ. I did work with Ilya before, so I'm happy for him. Yeah. So, I'm going for my goal. So, yeah. Up next, Hamza, we can't wait to see it. Congratulations. Thank you.